friends. Hola. Ready for dinner? Oh, shoot. I lost track of time. Just give me five minutes. What's that? Oh, just an audition scene from Marisol's movie. I'm trying out tomorrow. There's a part based on me. I had no idea. You know what? Forget dinner. I want to help with your audition. Really? That would be amazing. So, what are you going to wear? OK, I'm thinking about these heels with my maid's uniform. Maid's uniform? Good idea. What do you think about these earrings? Are they too much? Perfect. I love them. Really? Oh, I have another pair I can give you. Wow, thank you. <laughs> Why are you walking like me? I admire your confidence. I want to be just like you. I get it. Who doesn't want to be like Carmen Luna? Who doesn't want to be like Carmen Luna? No, que quiero at the end. Carmen Luna. Carmen Luna. Aww. It's like looking in the mirror. I know. Now, let's run your lines. I want to hear Uy, qué peligrosa. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know that I would ask her for help with my Yes, I agree. <laughs> we have beautiful Argentinian actress Sol Rodriguez. Bravo! Yay! Yay! Let's give his mates. So, are you ready for the hua, baby? What's the the hua? Well, on the count of three, we all sit down and we scream hua. Okay. One, two, three. Hua! hua! <laughs> First of all, I want to try. I want to try what I just saw because I want to see if I if I can do it as good as you and Rosalyn. Carmen Luna. No, 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 you have to pick it up at the end. Okay. Carmen Luna. Carmen Luna. <laughs> Perfect, she's gonna love it. She's gonna Ooh. love you, yeah. Okay, You're awesome. Diva. Is she gonna love me? She's gonna love you. Okay, uh, you know, I'm engaged, but if I wasn't, I'd say get her on the phone right now and set me up on a date. <laughs> no, she's happily married. I'm sure she is. In Miami, we used to, because I'm, I'm from Miami, and we used to have Ocean Drive parties and all that stuff, and she was at every party, oh. always promoting vodka, but she never drank, though. Does she drink? Did she drink? Uh, no, 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 no. Okay. We went Did out you a ever meet Sol yeah. in Miami? She used How to live there, too. That's right. You look too young to, I mean, this, I can't, I've been in LA for like 10 years. Oh, no. Yeah. I've been in Miami 10 years, and I just moved to LA a year when ago. I got, when I left, you got there, and then when I got, OK, so that's how it worked. Yeah, yeah, Did you go to an all-girls school or a Catholic school growing up? Uh, yeah, in Guatemala. Wait, but I thought you were from Argentina. I'm from Argentina, but I moved to Guatemala when I was eight. What was that like? Uh, I, I liked it. I like I like Guatemala a lot. It's very people don't know that country. Yeah. And um, I mean people know about it, but we don't know as much yeah. about it. There's not like a lot of Guatemalan yeah, yeah, totally. celebrities or anything totally. like that. Totally. It's a small it's, country. It's, just, it's very small and it's just beautiful. It's a beautiful country and I love it and I go back all the time and I have friends there. Yeah. Now they no all memories. know you. They claim you as their own. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I, tell us a little bit about how you started, because we know you were part of Grachi with Nickelodeon, yeah. right? Yeah. So that was really the boom with everything. So how was that? Like, you got to Miami, and then you're like, oh, I want to be an actor. Then what? Um, I No, it was not like that. So I, tell us. Yeah, I, was, <laughs> I moved to Miami with my parents, and um, I signed up in a talent agency to do commercials to get some extra money and do extra cash and stuff. And they sent me to an acting audition without me ever acted before. And I went there and I got the role and it ended up being Gachi for Nickelodeon. Oh my God, what a strike of loss. <laughs> <laughs> lucky you, huh? Very, very what? lucky. I know, it was so <laughs> unexpected. Yeah, and I did Gracie, and after that, I haven't stopped working. Yeah, that's because, I mean, I do have to mention that I met you in um, mm -hmm. Telemundo, in Mariana yes. Alquiler. Yeah, I was going to say, even you girls work together. Hello. Yeah, that was fun. So, on, is that yeah. a telenovela? Yeah. yeah, it is. What was it like working on a telenovela? Were you on it at the same time? Fun, well, right? I think it was your first telenovela after Gracie, right? Eh, Mariana Alquiler? Alquiler? Yeah, Alquiler. Yeah, yeah, it was my first. So, fue so. primero, fue primero eh, Gracie, después Mariana Alquiler con Telemundo, y fue ahí donde nos conocimos. Sí. No tuvimos escenas juntas. No. Eso sí, no. Éramos, yo era But la was, mala, maldita me fue. And you're la mala here on the zoo. No. Wait, did you She's got... typecast as la mala everywhere she no. goes. <laughs> no, ella es niña buena. Sí, niña buena. Pero bueno, le tocó a Sol, te, le tocaba hacer muchísimo eh, baile también. Ah, sí. She dances very well. Bailaban Mariana Alquiler, that's true, I totally forgot. Yeah, yeah. yeah but it was... Y movía la cintura y no sé qué cosa. Yeah, don't make, don't make me... No, 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 we won't, don't worry, don't worry. And then after Mariana Alquiler, I want to talk about el personaje de Mente Criminal. Oh, it was a girl, total... that's crazy, that show. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's Dennis, a you watch murder, murder, murder. Yeah, yeah. killer. It's, a, it's a based on a true yeah. story about this Venezuelan uh, psychiatrist that... Chirinos. 
Chirinos that um, abused his patients. Mm. But we have a crazy Venezuelan that's an executive producer on the show, and he talks to me the entire time. He wants to tell you that Richard Cabral, something Isaac, they're all Guatemalan Isaac. people. I have not. Like, Facundo Cabral. Cabral. Oh, Isaac, Isaac. Eh, but guys, yeah, yeah. guys, we have had a great Guatemalans. conversation, but you know what I want to know about? Devious Nates. <laughs> yeah, let's talk about you. What's going on with Devious Nates? What's yeah, your character thank going you. through this year? Um, well, I'm the new, um, the new, I just got distracted by that. <laughs> 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 I'm the yeah, new addition to the show. I'm nice. Rosalind's daughter. And next week, um, it's the final episode. Oh, no! Of the season. So we're crossing fingers for season five. I think so. I think it'll do well. I although, think... although at the beginning, when it first started, there was always that controversy about the hey, Latinas playing the maids and people wanted to get rid of it yeah. even before Very it Very stereotypical. A How do you feel bit. about yeah. that, though? But you know what? It's just, no. I see it as a show of four women just being funny. Like, we're funny. It's a funny show. It's a comedy, a dramedy, and so I just feel like it's a show about four women that are funny and they have their own life stories and go through a lot of stuff. And I don't see it as a maid show, mm -hmm. you know, like it just they happen to be maids. And and they happen to be Latina maids, and they, they happen, happen to be, to be charismatic, Latina. amazing, and they would rule the and world. Beautiful. And they got the opportunity. And, oh, they're always beautiful. They're stunning. We're, we're gonna, gonna go on commercial, Dennis. No, yes. you want no, Dennis, I'll, you take it out. Thank you so much, darling. We're gonna talk. We're gonna talk more about this when we come back. But <laughs> folks, stay right here because we have more with Sol Rodriguez right here on the zoo. Yeah. <laughs> We are back with Saul Rodriguez from Devious Maze. First of all, guys, is that tropical music that comes it's, into our no, bunker? No, it's like... T I feel like we might be getting electrocuted. By, yeah. by the <laughs> That's yeah. what it is. Thanks. Oh, the, uh, uh. I heard like something ballads or something back there. By the way, Saul, so, um, you know, we, we do love Devious Maze. We think it's funny. We, uh, I think it's kitschy and campy, and I always can appreciate that. And we love the poster and the idea behind it. So, um, first of all, we're going to show the poster of Devious Maze. So, so uh -huh. the poster. That always catches my attention when I'm driving down the street and I see the right. billboard. I always stop to look at every single one of them. Yeah. And then people honk <laughs> behind me because they're like, <laughs> oh, but we came up with our own spin-off because, you know, we have a, a Latino cast, you okay. know, one beautiful Latina woman and three uh -huh. uh, crazy Latino guys, and uh, <laughs> we're doing the spin-off called Deceitful Janitors. What? And this is, uh, this is the poster right here. Uh, no, that's Steve. I'm what? like... There we go, Deceitful oh Janitors. What? What? There we go. <laughs> 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 we don't look as that sexy so as the Devious Maze. What's oh up with that? So yeah. what we need for you, can you go I ahead and go into hair. the Lifetime offices? <laughs> yeah, well, he always I wanted to style yeah. like that. Guys, we, we, we this, is our, this, is, this is our hookup right now. So oh, can you go true. into the Lifetime offices and propose this? You can be the executive producer okay. of the spinoff. Okay, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. 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 Record. And happening. guest star, hello. Yeah, yeah. she's going to yeah. be like that. We need special appearance. <laughs> that was really good. That was really <laughs> funny, actually. Um, so something important to mention about Sol, and I do have to say this, not because she's a friend right. and, and a fellow acting partner, um, but I think it's amazing and very admirable that all your characters have been so different from one another, from the grachi, like, cute girl, to this, um, you know, Marido en Alquiler, the dancer, like, also the teenager kind of person, and then the crazy. You were schizophrenic, no? And the mental criminal. Yeah. And now this like, whole like Latino empowered, uh, yeah. going after my dreams. Yeah. yeah. I think that um, I just asked my agents and managers to trust me, because I do say no to a bunch of things that I don't feel like they're interesting. Really? Like what? Um, we want to know examples without names. Like just like. I get a lot of, obviously I'm Latina, right? So I'm always gonna, I have an accent and I, my looks, so I'm always gonna cast for the Latina role. But sometimes it's just like, just like suffering for like, you know, like poor Latina mm. that suffers because mm. her Like, I don't wanna do that all the time. And that was in your life necessarily, right? So it doesn't resonate no, with you. No, so it's, but I mean, you can play whatever you want. No, it doesn't resonate, I wasn't. So it's a but cliche. It's, yeah, but you know, sometimes you have to take it because that's what, People, that's what sells. Right. But and you gotta work. And you, Let's and be honest. Work, yeah. When a lot of people money. criticize, you know, certain shows, it's like you gotta I work. Agree. I, I mean, agree. you could do that in a telenovela as the um, as a lead role, but if you're in Hollywood trying to yeah. break into the American yeah. market, why would you want to go into something you can do yeah. in Televisa, Telemundo, Univision, right. yeah, yeah, yeah. Caracol, right. and right. compañía? Absolutely. Wait a second. One thing that I don't think you could say no to 
was those hot and steamy scenes with your coworker <gasps> on Devious Maids. Háblanos acerca de eso, porque eso es lo que I a mí me encanta. I cannot say no, show. indeed. Yes. <laughs> it was, um, Hello. Oh, Nathan, Nathan is so... <laughs> Nathan who? Who's this lucky guy? Oh. Nathan. Lucky girl. I mean, seriously, this guy's a hunk. <laughs> He's, he's pretty hot. Well, from my perspective, he's a lucky guy. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. We want to know this. Did it get you in trouble? Um, it was a, the, this uh, hot These scenes, scenes yes. that we did that uh, for that episode. We spent the whole day just like making out and like. Oh, you poor <laughs> thing. And then I, no, no, no. At the beginning it was like fun, but by the end of the day I had like a rash around my mouth oh. from his because he had like a little. That happened. Whoa. <laughs> Just from making out so much, so it was not as fun anymore. Wow, the, the grittier of the side of she romance. She was bleeding like from that. the mouth. I was yeah, like, wet hair, like, like, like a clown. And everyone's eating Oreos, and there's just like cookies <laughs> everywhere. Like, so yeah, yeah, what you see, it's not really. Pero fue tu primera uh, vez haciendo wow. ese tipo Savage. de. Savage. You know what? Yeah. Savage. You really? know what? Yeah, because you know what? In Telemundo, that was like this is my very, very first show here in like in Hollywood in English. So all that I've done before is I was always 18, not more than that. So my scenes were just like a little kiss and maybe like, you know, like, yeah, <laughs> like but it. nothing intense. <laughs> so my first time doing something intense was in Devious Maze with Nathan. Do you have to have like a glass of wine before the scene just to loosen up? No. I had a lot of mints and... Um, a lot of mints. <laughs> mints. What about, look at Bruno over here. Uh, what if you had to do a makeout scene with a guy that has a beautiful stash like this? Would you get a rash? Oh wow, how about this? The third scene, I would be like all red. Yeah, <laughs> right. But it would take the shape, right? It would curl. So, so be, it might make a nice like henna tattoo. You know, it could be an art piece. You never know. Could. Yeah. So did, does case, that yeah. kind of thing get you in trouble with like your boyfriend or... Do you no, have a boyfriend? I don't know that. No, I've been single for several years. Okay, so, I'm so you're good. I wasn't in trouble with anyone. Wow. Awesome. Bro, no, 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 you're no. single. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So, not several years. So yeah. I want to ask your opinion. <laughs> so, you know, she said some nice things about you. I, I want to ask your opinion on her. Why do you think she's always typecast as the, the bad girl? Is it those impossibly dark eyes that she has? <laughs> impossibly dark eyes. Talk about your life. friend right here. Why do, do we cycle? Get... It's not a mean thing. I, I look. I no, think, no, no, no. I think it's sexy Beautiful that you're always cast as the bad girl. Okay. I think it's kind of like, ooh, intriguing. Maybe it can, because she can bring it. She has the fire inside mm. that a Latina girl has, and it's just a fire that you bring. It's, it's just you have to be strong, mm. and you have to have a fire inside you to play the bad girl. Not everyone can. And do And you it. have it's to be easy. strong to be like the one, the one female on the easy. cast with a bunch of us guys. So <laughs> to me, see. it's harder to yeah. be a good one because I think some people can get pissed very easily and like right. short fused. Yeah. I think I'm short fused, but mm. I think I am too. Uh -oh. We're yeah. gonna short. Wow. We're gonna you short fuse the segment because we need to go to commercial. <laughs> so thank you so much oh, for yeah. joining thank us. Thank you, guys. Gracias. Gracias. No, no, it's the end of the show. It's the end of the show. Oh my God! No, short fuse the whole show. It's over. Okay, guys, thank you for joining us so and to all our fabulous guests today. Yeah. Remember, you can look at us. Uh, look, you can look us up online at the Zoo on LA TV. See you next time right here on LA TV. Oh, <laughs>